Here's how to fix if Apple Intelligence is not available on your iPhone. Now, if you have an iPhone, a newer or older one, and you've upgraded to the latest iOS 18, but it's still not showing Apple Intelligence as a feature or an option, I'm gonna walk you through the entire process. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, there are a couple things to keep in mind. Let's open up this article by Apple on their Apple Intelligence. And at the very end of this article, there's some really helpful information. The first thing to note is the iPhone basically needs to be a newer iPhone for it to be eligible with Apple Intelligence. So what it says on here, it will be available for iPhone 16, iPhone 16 Plus, iPhone 16 Pro, iPhone 16 Pro Max, iPhone 15 Pro, and iPhone 15, 6, 15 Pro Max. Now, keep in mind, there are these basically five or six different phones that will be available to use Apple Intelligence. If you have an older iPhone, either an iPhone 15, just a regular iPhone 15, or anything older, iPhone 14, iPhone 13, or iPhone 12, any of those, you will not ever be accessing Apple Intelligence. Basically, your phone doesn't have enough processing speed and RAM to be able to use and process the Apple Intelligence. So you need a newer phone. And the other thing that it says on here, Apple Intelligence will be free, but it will be available in beta starting next month, AKA October. So keep in mind, we're in September of 2024, around October of 2024, late October 2024, it will release Apple Intelligence. However, you can get it early just by going into your settings, tap on general here, and then software update. Now, what you're gonna do is tap on beta updates here, and you can choose to have an iOS 18 public beta or a developer beta. Once you've done that, you'll be able to see it will allow you to update to iOS 18.1, which includes Apple Intelligence within it. After you've done that, you can just go back here and you'll be able to see under the action button is Apple Intelligence. I can tap on it. You might need to apply or go on a wait list to be given access to Apple Intelligence. I did this and it took about 10 minutes for me to be approved. So just apply or request access to Apple Intelligence. And then most likely within 10, 15 minutes, you can just go back here and all you have to do is toggle it on and you'll start being able to get all of the basically features within Apple Intelligence and they'll continually roll out new features as they update iOS. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you still have any questions. Thanks, guys.